And of course, our escape plan is a failure, bro. Yo, what is good, y'all? It's your boy Reefy here, and I'm back with part 33 of the Walking Dead, the Telltale Definitive series. Last video, right? Mad stuff went down, right? For starters, Gabriel helped Javier escape that prison cell. And also, eventually down the line, Javier and Gabe went to go get some guns, and Javier ended up getting stabbed in his arm. So then, eventually, Javier and Clementine reunite with each other, and Clementine stitches Javier's arm. Also, Javier, Gabe, and Kate separated from Trip and Eleanor. Why, you might ask? It's because Trip found out that Javier killed um what's this dude's name um um conrad yeah conrad to save gabe and clementine so trip didn't take too kindly to that and yeah now we're here searching for some kind of truck yo no funny shit gabe really pissed me off in the last video like he's just so stupid and impulsive bro like i don't care if he's a teenager or none of that and that's what teens do but i don't care i don't like the dude <laughs> <clears throat> How very observant of you, Javier. Um, let's see. Uh, is there anything we could do with this excavator right here? Can we use it somehow? I doubt we can use it. I doubt, like, there's, like, a battery or it's, it's works, you know? This thing looks like it moves too slow for an escape. Yeah, that is true. Oh, what was... Oh, I thought Clementine was gonna come say something. Let's see what Clementine gotta say. What's going on? Thanks. For what? Yeah, you don't say, Javier. Yeah, yeah also, my bad if y'all hear my air conditioner. It's really, really hot today. Like, it's really, it's it's mad fucking hot outside today. You got it. So, yeah, we're gonna keep looking for this truck. Okay, bulldozer. That looks like it moves too slow for an escape, too. Um, hmm, there might be something under this garage, though. So, let's go under this garage, though, and see what's behind the garage door. There it is. Oh, this is the truck. Let's go. What are we going to do? Are we going to bust through the door? Okay, good thing we didn't, because if we, if we would have, then mad uh, walkers would have pulled up, because, you know, they attracted some noise. What are the chances? I'd say about 50-50. All right, let's open. Is there somebody in there or something in there? Oh, never mind. I guess not. Who the hell is that? Down. I almost moved it too late. I almost moved the analog stick too late. Early risers. Come on, we gotta hurry and finish before more people wake up. Oh boy. Oh boy. Uh uh uh. So we gotta distract them somehow, right? Okay. You steer. The rest of us are gonna get behind the truck and push. See if we can't get some distance between us and them. But nah, real talk, I can't believe there's only two more seasons left. It really feels like just yesterday I bought this game and decided to and decided I was gonna play it for YouTube. So like, I've wanted to get into these Telltale games more because um I play Until Dawn and I love those games where it's like a butterfly effect where every decision you make matters, you know? And plus I kinda wanted to get into the walking deck because I never watched the show or read the comics, but like I said, this is the most experience I've ever had with the Walking Dead. And it's, plus, I'm like a fan of zombie survival, undead type of thing, uh, t uh, type of things. Just push the truck. Glad you were here. I'm trying to keep you safe. Yo, you want to shut up and push the truck, yo? Like, bro, shut up. I want to knock this little nigga out so badly, bro. He's such an annoying smartass, bro. <laughs> They definitely will, I'm not gonna hold you. Couldn't find an ignition key in there. And how do they not hear the truck being pushed? Like did, 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 how do they not hear it? You know what I'm saying? Try not to shock yourself. Shit. I'll need something to strip the wires. They left all their supplies lying around. Bet there'll be some tools out there somewhere. Just try to hurry, okay? Got you. We gotta move as fast as we can. Oh, there's a toolbox right there. Conveniently located. Alright, so let's open it. Are there any wire cutters? Alright. Oh, there's the wire cutters right there. Oh my god, of course! 
All right. Um. Um. um what? A, wait. Did I, did I? Did I move too late? There we go. Reminds you of that scene from Orphan where the little girl bashed that nun's head in with a hammer. Speaking of Orphan, they're making a sequel. Then, yeah. Almost there. Keep an eye out while I get it started. Okay. I'll check on the guy from the office. Clem and I will look out for walkers. Okay. Don't get yourself killed. Here goes. My bad. I just got a call from a random number and. Yeah, the voicemails, it sounded like they were speaking backwards, but yeah. Anyways, let's open this up and hotwire the car. Square. There we go. Alright, I don't know what the hell I'm doing. Alright, what do I cut? Do I cut the... What What am I supposed to cut? Ignition wire, the battery wire, or the starter wire? I'm guessing the, the ignition wire. Right? And strip the wire. That... What... what uh, I guess the starter wire. I I don't. I genuinely don't know what I'm doing at all. Well, I thought you had to cut a specific one. I. Okay. Okay, we had to connect to the battery to to the ignition. Okay, so that's the ignition. That's the battery. So yeah, let's connect these. Let there be light. There we go. <laughs> Of course, of course, bro. Of course, be of course the wall would break down. Of course it would. Now the other people are gonna come out here, realize we're stealing their truck, and everybody is gonna be half past fucked. You know what I'm saying? Because why should things ever go smooth in this game? You feel me? Yeah, please don't get electrocuted, Javier. Please don't. Zap. 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 I thought he was gonna get electrocuted. I'm not gonna hold y'all. Yeah, let's get let's get out of here. Oh god. Oh yeah, they noticed. All right, let's get out of here. There we go. Whew. I wonder who we stole that truck from. Like, who were those people that we stole from? You know. Okay, we made it back. This is like the truck that they, that they use for heist in Grand Theft Auto Five or something. This is a good place to wait. Do we have enough gas? I'm not about to turn the engine. I hope so. What now? We wait for Ava to call us on the walkie. I still don't trust Ava. Nothing for us to do but sit and watch the sun come up. Seems like it. We've got something important to do. I'm what? You to play euchre. That's not a real thing. What the hell is euchre? <laughs> come on, it's fun. It's nice to be driving around with a couple kids in the back seat again. Ah, just like old times. Those are good times. It hurts to think about. There's things I don't miss. Yeah, don't don't say there's things you don't miss. That's 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 not that's not nice. Yo, fat, for real, the rest in peace, Mariana. That kid did not deserve that. That should have been Gabe instead of Mariana. I'm gonna be honest with y'all. Do what I do. Try to think about the nice stuff, not everything that happened after. Gotcha. Come on, that's not even a good rule. Still gotcha. Guess he stopped playing it cool with her. Hmm? Uh, in case you haven't noticed, Abe's got a little crush on Clementine. Yeah, it's mad obvious that he does. Like Hope it works so. out. I just don't like it. That's kind of crazy. That is crazy, though. I never would have expected that, you know? Guess it just goes to show. You stick two people together, something's going to happen between them. Well, she's trying to shoot a shot with Javier? Something this time around. It's so normal. You know, like as crazy as things get, as terrible and tragic and just plain stupid, there's nothing more wonderfully ordinary as two kids falling for each other. Yo, I really like Kate, bro. Falling is the easy part. I'd be a fucking wreck. I envy them. Um, I guess falling is the easy part. Falling in love is the easy part. It's the staying in love part that'll really mess you up. Yeah, you'd know a lot about that because of your trash ass marriage with David. But they're feeling what they're feeling right now, and when that sun gets a little higher, it's right back to the fight. I just wish I could have had a childhood, you know? I wish I could have given them that. Him and you did your best, the world is going, we still can't. Bro, like I said previously, like, Kate is a stepmother that loves her stepkids, and she's obviously doing the best she can. 
Because no matter how much Gabe pushed her away, she still wanted to, she still loved Gabe no matter what, you know? She's really doing her best, bro. She, she's a great mother. She really is. Aww. You're so sure what you're doing all this for. You didn't run away. I'm not so sure that's who I am. People need me. Um hmm. but you didn't. I guess I'm not so sure. Honestly, I'm not that sure of anything right now. I'm just trying to do the right thing. I get it. There's no graceful way to say this, so I'm just gonna say it. Let me guess she's in love with Javier. I know we've had moments. You and I. And they're always a little hot and a little confusing. And maybe some of them haven't meant anything at all. Really? Wait, 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 wait. What's she talking about? What's she talking about? What's she talking about? Wait, wait, wait. I need you to know. I love you, Javier. Whatever this thing is between us. I want to give it a chance. I knew it. I knew it. I knew she was in love with Javier. It was clear as day that she is. It makes this whole thing a little more complicated. But do you feel the same way? I really like yes, I want to be with you. No, I don't feel that way. Oh, y'all know what time it is. It's time for another coin flip. Oh, wait, let me see the choices again. Crazy. If we get if we get heads, we're gonna shoot our shot. If not, we're gonna dub it. So, I'm, I'm sorry. If we get tails, we're gonna dub it. So I'm gonna flip a coin real quick. Ooh, I got heads. I got heads. Oh man, oh man. How is this gonna unfold? Ah oh, man, bro. Damn, you about to take my son about to TYB his whole brother. Oh, in front of Gabe and Clementine? No, no, that, don't do that in front of them. Okay. Yeah. Shit. We're doing this. You do I mean, hey, I guess, I guess it's all right because they're in the middle of a zombie apocalypse and they don't know when they're gonna die, right? Hope you can handle it. That'd be appropriate. Do we have to? I just want to be able to tell him in person. Damn. <laughs> Shit. I mean, apparently, from what Kate was saying and from what we've seen, Dave was kind of a shitty husband to her, but. Hoping he doesn't completely flip out. He's gonna completely flip Considering out. We're about to save his life. Maybe he'll cut us a break. Javi, it's an execution over here. She's planning to hang Danny in front of the whole crowd. Nani? You gotta get over here now. Don't bring the truck. If they see it, they'll kill him right away. Yo, now it's time for us to save David. Shit. I just hope Gabe doesn't ruin it for us. Is Kay gonna stay in the car? I'm going to hang back here with the truck. All right, bet. We'll tell you as soon as we've got David. Good luck. Damn, I really can't believe it. Nothing else from Ava? No, I was kind of hoping I'd get tails, but I like to do coin flips to like make things more interesting, you know. But just know, I'm not the type of person to do that. I would never take my brother's girlfriend or wife just because their relationship is bad. I, I wouldn't do it. If she shot her shot with me, I'd be like, nah, I'm good. All right, I'm not, no lie, I'm type worried about Ava. I'm, I'm not going to hold you. She's been helping us and like all of a sudden something happened. But yeah, I, I would never take my brother's girlfriend or wife. I, I, I don't care. It's, it's, it's not my thing. I'm, I'm not that kind of person. Yo, Gabe, shut up, bro. That is, I'm going to be. Glad to hear it. Oh, it's about to go down, bro. Yo, they really about to freaking hang David. It's like this. It's like the beginning of Assassin's Creed 2 where they hung Ezio's um father and brothers. We can't wait for the others, can we? For years now, Richmond has been governed by one simple principle. Strong council, strong community. Yo, this, this whole this lady's like a cult leader, bro. The actions of one of the members of that council, our security expert, 
David Garcia have put us all She's in lying danger. to all of you. Facts. I'm sorry to have to show you this. Truly, I am. No, you're not, you evil me. bitch. Fucking evil Just whore. Look what he's done. What did he do? He murdered this man in cold blood. Is this who we want in charge? Someone this reckless. This cruel. Yo, no lie. I thought that was Ava for a second. I can't believe this is really happening. Yo, same here, Gabe. She can't do this to him. Don't lose your cool. Yo, word, please do not lose your cool. Because knowing you, you're going to lose your cool and ruin this for all of us. We can't screw this up, Bobby. I should be telling you that, you little turd. I heard you were planning to crash our little party. Why did you come on up here? Show your face to everyone. I'm sure these people... Go to hell, Joan. I'll be happy to. What's in it for me? Yeah, go to hell. You wrinkled bag of bones. Don't make this harder on yourself, Javier. Get up here now. She knows we're here now. We might as well. Word. I had a very interesting conversation with your friend Eleanor last night. Isn't that right, Eleanor? There's no way that there's no way that this bitch ratted, bro. Yo, you know what's funny? Remember when Clementine was like, I don't trust Eleanor? Yo, Clementine was right. Clementine was right, bro. Like, oh my god, it really be a yo. If there's anything I learned from this game, is that you can't trust nobody, not even yourself, bro. You really can't trust nobody. Everybody is a snake, everybody's out for themselves, bro. Oh my god, Clementine was right the whole time, bro. She was right about Eleanor. I knew I should have listened to Clementine. I can't believe it. Um, um, I don't know. Uh, why punish David? I guess. If you knew what we were coming here to do, why go ahead with this? Why put a noose around my brother's neck? This community deserves justice, and they're going to get it, one way or the other. Here in Richmond, people who put themselves before the group don't last long. But now, real talk, back to um Eleanor and Javier, right? No way, no way, no, no. No, 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 no. Don't tell me one of them is gonna die, bro. Don't tell me it's Trip. Because I actually started liking Trip. No, actually, yo, so I was wrong not to trust Ava. Remember, I was saying I don't trust Ava? But yeah, back to Javier and Kate. Yeah, I'm not gonna like Kate deserves better from what she told us about David and what we've seen about David. So, yeah, there's that. But anyways, no, no. Was she gonna give us an ultimatum? No, come on, bro. I gotta pick. I wanna punch Eleanor in the face so badly right now. You just idiot, bro. Please don't do this. Stop playing games. Yo, facts. Please do not do this. You, you got it, El uh, Joan. Don't do this, bro. Bro, come on, don't make me choose, bro. In fact, let him let it know, Steve Buscemi. Come on, come on, come on, bro. I don't want to have to choose, bro. No, 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 please, bro. Save Ava. Oh my god, who do I save, bro? Bro, I don't even know who to save. Like, do I just want to pick somebody off the fly? Do I do a coin flip? What do I do, bro? Oh my god. Oh my god, I really don't know what to decide. I don't know what to do, bro. Do I save Trip or do I save, save Ava? Oh my god, no. No, no, no. No, fuck you, bitch. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. No, 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 bro. But I admire the sacrifice you're making here. Bro, I could I don't shoot it. Wait, I said don't shoot Ava. You did, but there's something else you need to understand. Wait, what? Is she gonna shoot Ava too? Joan, 
think about what you're doing. Yo, please think about what you're doing, lady. No, come on, bro. I, yeah, I know. Yo, this bitch is evil, bro. This bitch is the embodiment of pure evil. Go fuck yourself. You'll we'll pay for this. No, no. Oh, my God. He sh oh, my. No. No. I didn't know he was going to shoot the opposite person. Yeah, great observation skills, Gabe. Bro, this chick is the embodiment of pure evil, bro. Bro, I really hope this lady ends up dying at the end, bro. I can't this. Yo, I can't believe it either, Steve Buscemi. This is stop her, Clinton. This is BS. You're pathetic. Um, um, your words. Stop her. Is this the process you trusted? No. Think about this, Harvey. You know what's gonna happen here. Bro, we're gonna take this lady down, bro. I didn't know she was gonna kill the opposite person. That's how we've always done things. How about you take David and the rest of your people and just get the hell out? Go far away from Richmond, and then whatever you do is up to you. I'm sure the herd outside would like that. She thinks she's sending us out there to die. She's counting on it. Everybody put your guns away. We're going to handle this. Oh my god, this lady is the embodiment of pure e I really did not expect her to shoot Ava. Listen to them, Hobby. They're fucking butchers, all of them. Shoot that bitch! Take her out! Yo, I'm really tempted to shoot her. Um, wait, 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 wait. Let me not be so impulsive, because if I shoot Joan, the other guards are probably going to start killing everybody, and someone is going to die. You know what I'm saying? I don't... Oh, my God. So many decisions, bro. So many decisions, man. Oh, my goodness, Lord, bro. I, I don't know. Do, do I oh my goodness like what do I do bro do I put a, do I put a bullet in between Jones eyes or do I just oh, what do I do oh my god but oh my god I honestly as much as I want to put Joan on a t-shirt right now I I don't think that's a good idea because like I said the other guards might start shooting and start wilding bro and Gabe might die trip might die uh, 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 Clementine might die. David might die. You know what I'm. You know what I mean. So. Oh my God. 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 No, I said I was gonna take the deal, but oh my God, I don't. I don't know. If that's a good idea. Oh my God. I don't want to be too impulsive. Take the deal. And besides, we also have the truck too. Wait, what? This is how it needs to happen. Yeah, David. David definitely would have died had we have shot Joan. Is he gonna? Wait, what? I don't believe any of you. Take your deal and shove it. I can't blame David for feeling like that. One step closer, and I kill him. I swear I will. He would. Please don't do this. Think about your family. You're fucking everything up. Um, um, um. Yo, word, word, word. Please don't be impulsive, David. I know. I want. I'd want to shoot her too, but who did you just shoot? Gabe, don't you idiot! Get back! Are you stupid? Get back, bro! What are you doing, bro? Right. Oh my god, this is what I thought was gonna happen if had I shot Joan, bro. I probably should have shot her right then and there. I probably should have shot her, bro. Oh my god, bro. I can't believe she killed Ava, son. Gabe, you it. Jesus Christ. Oh my god, bro. Oh, wait, get back, get back, get back. Oh my god. Nah, bro. Yo! Shoot her! Shoot her! Get back here! Gabe, I need you to cover me. You gotta make things right. You just make Gabe to do all this? He's just a little boy, bro! What, what, what now? What now? Gabe, go home, Gabe. He doesn't need us. We're not here for revenge. 
What do I say? 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 Do I send Gabe? I'm not gonna send the Gabe out there to die. I hate this little boy so much, but I can't send a kid out there to die. We're not here here for revenge. He's clearly not. Word. Wow, you're actually listening? Oh my god. Alright, let's move up. Circle. Oh boy. Oh boy. This is not good. This is not good at all. Oh no. Uh, thank you, Trip. I'm surprised Trip. I'm surprised Trip didn't kill, didn't threaten to shoot Javier or something. You know, I'm, I'm, I'm genuinely shocked. Bro, that's his brother. They're shooting. What do you think is going on? Can't talk now. Get over here. We'll come to you. Um, um, we'll come to you. It's too risky for her to come in here with the truck. Oh boy. Uh oh. Tear gas. Yo, get out of there. Get out of there. Oh no. Move! Move it! Move it! Why would you stand there? There's a whole tear gas canister right there. Oh, X, 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 Triangle. Ooh, nice one, Javier. Okay, Kate with the rescue, I see you. Oh man, yo, Kate is really the goat, bro. Oh no, 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 no. No! No, come on, come on, do not kill off Kate. Please do not kill off Kate, bro. No, no, Kate is the last character I want to die in this season, bro. And of course our escape plan is a failure, bro. Bro, please tell me she managed to survive. Please, bro. Yo, please tell me she managed to survive right survive that explosion. Oh my god. Bro, come on. Yo, come on, bro. No, no, no. Kate cannot die, bro. I refuse to accept Kate dying. I refuse, bro. Yo, what take Gabriel? Are we finished up? Did you promise that you would help? Kate with the family if David left you 8.6% of the players told David that it was his responsibility bro it's his family why I gotta take care of it because he don't want to that's your family bro <coughs> how do you respond to Dr. Lingard's request you have 46.3% of players refuse to kill Lingard um okay Did you tell Kate that you have feelings for her? You and 78% of players told Kate you shared for- Really? I'm surprised most people shared their feelings with her. I'm genuinely shocked. Who did you try to save with the execution? You and 58.6% of players tried to save Ava. <sighs> Man, bro. Did you shoot Joan to take Clint's deal? You and 43.4% of players chose to take the deal. Ah, oh, man, bro. Damn, son. I- <sighs> All right, y'all. So I think I'm gonna call it a night and the video right here. Part 33 of the Walking Dead, the Telltale Definitive series. Thank y'all so so much for watching. The support really truly does mean a lot. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Turn on post notifications. Follow me on my socials down below. And yeah, I'm gonna be off this. Y'all take care. Have a good one. And I'll see y'all next time when we start the final episode of this of season three of the Walking Dead, the Telltale Definitive series. Take care, y'all.